Thanks for tuning in to GCP Sketch Notes, where we learn about one Google Cloud service at a time. I'm Priyanka Vergadia, and in this video, we are covering the different hybrid and multi-cloud deployment options with Anthos. I've covered Anthos previously, so if you have not checked that episode out, go ahead, do that. It's in the description. If you're already using Google Cloud, then use Anthos to build, deploy, and optimize your apps directly on Google Cloud. This provides a consistent development and operations experience for hybrid and multi-cloud environments. This is a great option for cloud-first companies, digital natives, and SaaS providers. The second option is if you're using VMware vSphere in your own on-premise environment, then you can choose to run them on Anthos cluster right there, modernizing your apps in the vSphere landscape. This is a good option if vSphere is a corporate standard for you, or if you have shared hardware across multiple teams or clusters and with integrated operating system lifecycle management. Another on-premise option is Anthos on bare metal, which lets you deploy applications directly on your own hardware infrastructure. It eliminates the dependency on the hypervisor layer, and you get to modernize while reducing cost. Because you're using your own hardware and network, you have direct control over application scale, security, and network latency, as well as having the benefit of containerized applications through GKE and Anthos components. Now, in the multi-cloud space, the attached clusters provides an ability to consistently manage existing AKS, EKS, and OpenShift clusters. It's great for pairing with Anthos native clusters and lowering operational overhead, providing a single pane of glass view for managing clusters across hybrid and multi-cloud. If you're already running some of your apps in AWS or Azure, then running an Anthos cluster on AWS or Azure respectively is a great idea because you can run in multiple cloud environments with common platform and API automation. So there you have it, six different hybrid and multi-cloud deployment options with Anthos. Depending on where your infrastructure is today, one or a few of these options will lead you to your cloud modernization journey. If you want to learn more, I have included a link to an entire blog below. If you are liking the GCP Sketchnote series, please let me know in the comments below and don't forget to subscribe for a new episode weekly.